the game. We have been contacted by Commander Sarish Mina of Deep Space Nine. She has requested your assistance with a delicate matter involving Cardassia and Bajor. Although Bajor is in world and we are technically at war, our ties with Bajor go back many years. Ambassador Worf even served on Deep Space Nine for a time. Therefore, we have negotiated for your services with Starfleet as a special dispensation. Help the commander, but never forget who you truly serve. Okay. Serve the Empire well. This is the Chancellor of the uh, Klingon Empire, Chancellor Jimpok. Approach Deep Space Nine. There are some truly big ships in the galaxy. Head is Deep Space Nine. This is Deep Space Nine control, Sis Station control, IKS Darong. They're ready to use the dock. Uh, been some renovations to the systems, uh, Captain. Uh, station captain, but I'm sure you'll be able to find your way around. Have a pleasant stay. Right, we're going to beam directly to Ox. And we will have a word with the Ambassador Slus here, who's a member of the Klingon High Council. See if he has any words of wisdom for us. What are you doing? Federation special. Sorry, I don't have any special orders for you at this time. What are you doing with special? Deep Space Nine and the wormholes are too important to be left there in the fumbling, pacifistic hands of the Federation. For the time being, it's important to have the Empire to, to the Empire to have a presence here. Admiral Devac's Omega Force initiative has given us a, a great deal of leeway through his joint task force. And as, su as a result, we have an opportunity to oversee the sector in spite of our current tensions with the Federation. What kinds of enemies are in uh, this area of space? In there are cer certain individuals among the Cardassians and the Dominion refuse to recognize the surrender of their governments at the end of the Dominion War. As a result, they continue to harass ships and conduct insurgency operations in the sector. We've also spotted unusual variations in Federation ship designs in the region. Starfleet claims they come from a mirror universe uh, and that they are not under Federation control. Regardless, you should have no qualms about engaging and destroying them. Right. Engaging and destroying? Yeah, I'm good at engaging and destroying uh, Federation. Right, let's talk to Federation. Uh, Commander Ni uh, Mina. How can I help you? Who are you? My name is Sarish Mina. I hold the rank of Commander in Starfleet. I am the Operations Officer for Deep Space Nine. I also serve informally as a liaison to the Bajoran Militia and the Vedic Assembly. And I'm the subject matter expert on Bajor. Being Bajoran myself, I know the people and have their trust. How can I help you? I was told to report to you. Welcome to Deep Space Nine, and thank you for coming so quickly. During the occupation of Bajor, many sacred artifacts were stolen and studied. After the bajoran cardassian Treaty was signed in 2371, these artifacts were supposed to be returned. However, the Obsidian Order, the Cardassian military intelligence branch, opposed the treaty and apparently hid at least some of these artifacts in their warehouses. We know this because we have been contacted by the Cardassian government. 
There is a faction among the Cardassians called the True Way that rejects the treaty with the Federation. This organization infiltrated a defunct Obsidian Order facility and stole an Orb of the Prophets. That sounds religious. These orbs are precious to our people. They have been given to us by the Prophets. They possess mysterious and unusual powers. Many of them grant visions to supplicants. We believe the True Way are operating out of a base in the Badlands. We would like you to travel to the Badlands and attempt to recover the orb on behalf of the Bajoran people. I will track down those responsible for stealing the orb of the Prophets. How can I help you? 